the MathD contest in the year of 2002. So, yeah, pretty long time ago, right? 21 years ago. And he has a lot of questions. This is just like the collection of the past exams. And uh, I did a couple of this when I was in high school. So this is the one right here. So, yeah. Good memories, but anyway, though, we are given x times f of x is, um, plus f of negative x is equal to x to the third power, and we are going to find the value for f of 2. So go ahead, pause the video, and try it first. Done? Do you want to know the answer first? Okay, I'll tell you. The answer is 8 over 5. If you got it right, leave a comment down below, but still watch the video, though. Alright, so how do we do it? We just want f of 2, right? And you see here we have f of x, f of negative x. You can plug in any x for you that you want. So let's go ahead. Of course, the natural thing is just plugging x equals 2. And that will give us 2 times f of 2, and then plus f of negative 2. And then that's equal to 2 to the third power, which is 8, of course. But this is not enough because I cannot just solve for this. This is spotting us. I don't know what, how big this is, right? So we have to sound get rid of that. How? Well, don't worry. Because this is x. That's f. Uh, that's negative x. Just plug in negative 2. So we can still end up with a similar equation. Check this out. Next, I'm going to plug in x equals negative 2 into all the x's. So we get negative 2 times f of negative 2 and then plus f of negative but then we have the negative 2 right here so double negative like this and that is equal to negative 2 to the third power so now you have two equations to work with and you want to get rid of the f of negative 2 so that you can solve for f of 2 it's like a system of equations this one is not so bad how do we get rid of that here we have negative 2, so you want to have a 2 right here, right? Let's take the first equation and multiply everybody by 2. This equation <laughs> has so many 2's. Check this out. Let me write this down first, right? So I will take this and then multiply by that. So I will have 2, f of negative 2, and then do the rest. We get plus 4, f of 2, and that's 8. 8 times 2, we get 16. Alright? And then for this right here, I'm just going to put it down. We have negative 2 times f of negative 2, and this is just f of 2. So plus f of 2, and that's the negative 2 star power, so that's negative 8. Now look at these equations, add them up. They cancel out very nicely. This is 4 f of 2 plus one more, so we have 5f of 2 equals this and that, when we add them we get 8. So finally, divide the 5 on both sides, f of 2 is nicely equal to 8 over 5. And uh, that's it, let me just box this right here, yeah, that's it. Alright, go ahead, try to figure out what f of x is. Alright, 